You're the best looking table clamp I've ever seen. Oh boy, thanks baby. I did it again. What's wrong? Oh my God, are you kidding me? <gasps> Just for a little backstory, we had to go get this jigsaw from a friend because our jigsaw stopped working. <gasps> Help! Previously on BB in the RV. I know you want to quit. You did it! Baby! Babe, you did it. Hold it over your head. Let's go find out that that works tomorrow and then just put it back in. In a fun twist, uh, the tank does work. Yeah. We had a propane specialist come out to inspect the tank. He said, you're fine, you're good to go. Just clean the surface rust off and put a fresh coat of paint, and uh, that's what we're gonna do. Since Dave's already gone ahead and grinded off all of the rust, now I'm just gonna clean up the little bit of film that's left on there and then spray them with some paint and primer in one. Just black, like a satin finish, not too glossy, not too flat. Get these all in tip top shape and then we'll put them back in today. We had two issues originally. Uh, number one was when we went to fold in this, it was hitting right here. So we needed to lower the steps slightly, step them down so that there was enough clearance here. Number two we discovered is even when we were able to get this in, it would hit the bolts and so it couldn't, and so it couldn't clear it. So we stepped it down and trimmed the bolts. So now our stairs are fully functioning. Come on, come on, hey, up, up, down. Did I look as crazy as last night? Uh, no, but still pretty crazy. It's a long day. And we're probably, we were gonna go have a date night, which I thought would be fun. And it's a very sweet notion, but I think I need to take a shower and order pizza or something. What order? checked with the floodlight and filled any holes that we saw, but to be super safe, one more layer in between, flex seal in each quadrant, and then it's time for the actual subfloor. Plywood time. When Dave's working and I don't want to bother him, um, I hold my boards like this. I honestly had no idea that she was doing that. Girls gotta do what a girl's gotta do. Cut your foot off? I'm an independent woman. I don't need no man.
Okay, we're getting it in. We're doing what we like to call the Jason Derulo. Dave? Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Yay, babe! <laughs> As we did that, I could, I started to smell you. Like, you did not smell eight minutes ago. Now the camper smells like mad. This video is going to be called how to find this crazy angle it doesn't really look like an angle but it's a slight out and back up and that's what gives it that cool shape step one take your board and keep cutting different angles until something lines up with the edge of your rv step two take that board go outside your rv line it up perfectly with the edge whatever's left Hanging. Draw a pencil line. Step three, take this thing and cut that thing off. Step four, check your work. I have a teeny bit of overhang that I'm just gonna go ahead and sand off. All right, step a million. Make this angle, <laughs> put that together, notch out this thing because of this thing, put that behind that cord, make it up as you go, make a really sexy angle. We are making it up. Hey babe, uh, your leg's bleeding again. This girl's a boss. That's my wife to be. Uh -huh. What to do with that angle? Make a little template. I refuse to stop until we frame this one. How are we feeling? Oh, you know. Well, my friends, in a different universe, right now we would be saying our I do's and getting married. Uh, we had to postpone our wedding due to COVID and we're gonna get married next year, but right about this time in upstate New York, we would have been getting married. So, cheers, we'll do it next year. Love you. You have a boogie in your nose. I have to tell you. We were supposed to get married yesterday. We were supposed to get married yesterday. We were like, we were like sitting down to dinner. We went out to a really nice steakhouse um, to kind of like celebrate. Courtesy of our parents, they're very sweet. Celebrate what would have been our wedding day. It was kind of a sad day, so they like treated us to like, a hotel room and. We just kept saying it felt very alternate university. Yeah, I had already bought a dress. We picked like the colors and the flowers and we had a florist and a photographer and a band. I can't even imagine that we were gonna get married today, like. And this one 24 hour period and you plan it within an inch of its life and then it's like we overslept or something and we like forgot to do it. But last night was very nice. That was nice. And now I'm excited to go work on Penelope again. I know. <laughs> it is really nice to go straight back to work. We miss her every second we're not working on her. I do. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, hit the subscribe button below. You can follow us on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, TikTok. All the things at BB and the RV. We're gonna have a new episode coming out really soon. Uh, it's very satisfying. We're gonna be in 100 degree heat taking black tar off of this roof. I don't know who did that to us, but we're <laughs> taking it off and re-roofing it with a really nice white reflective roof that's gonna keep the RV nice and cool. So that one's worth checking out. Uh, thanks again so much for watching. Thanks guys. See you next week. Bye.